my name is Amy Grawe. I'm a family physician and I also practice breastfeeding medicine. I'm a board certified lactation consultant. I own my own medical practice called Little Flower Family Medicine and that's located in O'Fallon, Missouri. Tongue and lip tie are treated by cutting out the small piece of tissue that should not be there. So there are several ways to cut. One way to cut is actually with scissors. Um, that can lead to some bleeding, as you might imagine. Another way to cut is using a scalpel. This is typically more often done in an operating room. Some providers use something called electrocautery, which is electricity to use to burn the tissue. Um, and now more providers are using a dental laser. So many people are familiar with what a laser pointer is. It's just a light. So a dental laser is a laser that has a different wavelength, so essentially it's a little bit hotter than your laser pointer. So the light is touched over the tissue and the heat actually sort of melts the tissue away. And in the process, it actually cauterizes the blood vessels so that there's no bleeding. And what this allows is the surgeon to have very precise surgery. So you can touch a little piece of tissue, wipe this off of the gauze pad, look again and make sure you've done the complete release. And if you haven't, a little bit more tissue can be removed until the person has a full motion of the lip or full motion of the tongue. In our office, we treat a lot of babies who are breastfeeding babies. So when this procedure is done in our office, we use an exam table and a swaddle blanket. So we swaddle the baby so that they're very still. I have an assistant and the assistant holds the baby's head and and we usually put a towel roll under the neck so the baby's head is in an extended position so that I can see what I'm looking at. And then the assistant holds the baby's chin down. This is to keep the mouth open again so I can see what I need to revise. There's a tool called a groove director and it's a metal tool with smooth edges that you can lift the tongue up with the groove director. And the the frenulum or the tongue tie, a little piece of tissue actually goes right into the groove director and that guides the tissue and holds it very still. And in that way, the laser can be touched to the tissue. And I explained to parents that if you've ever touched a hot pot and you touch the hot pot and you hold it down, it hurts quite a bit. But if you ever touched a hot pot on the stove and you just touched it briefly, it doesn't hurt so bad. And so you touch it a little bit at a time. So when I do surgery with the baby with a laser, Lifting up the tongue, I use the laser and I touch just briefly and then that tissue is removed and I let the tissue cool off. And then another light touch over here and that tissue is removed. So after three or four touches, the entire frenulum has been removed and the tension has been released. 